Martin Luther Short Biography Martin Luther, Protestant Reformer Martin Luther is a professor of theology and a Catholic priest from Germany. Luther is known for initiating the Protestant Reformation which brought about a change in the history of world Christianity. His decision to translate the Bible into German did not only have an impact on the church or German culture. The following is a biography of a pastor who wants church members to get closer to God. Childhood Martin Luther was born on November 10, 1483 in Aesleben, Mansfeld County, Holy Rome Region. Son of Hans Luther and Margarethe Lindemann. His parents were farmers although Hans also had success in mining. Hans wanted Luther to become a lawyer. So at the age of seven his father sent Luther to a Latin school in Mansfeld, then to Magdeburg in 1497. A year later, he returned to Aesleben and studied grammar, rhetoric, and logic. The lesson he calls Purge in Hell. In 1501 when he was 17 years old, he entered the University of Erfurt and obtained a Master of Art in Grammar, Logic, Rhetoric, and Metaphysics. Becoming a Priory One of the most important moments in Luther's life occurred on July 2, 1505. At that time, he was on his way back to campus. During a thunderstorm, lightning struck near Luther. To his father, he said he was so afraid of death and eternal judgment. Please. Santa Anna, I want to become a monk. Said Luther in his screams. Then decided to quit law school. He sold his book, and entered St. Augustine's Abbey in Erfurt on July 17, 1505. A decision that received a negative response from both family and friends. Luther dedicated his life to the Order of Augustine. Among them pray, pray, make pilgrimages, and carry out confessions. Even so, Luther's early life was easy. The reason, he did not find the spiritual enlightenment as he had been looking for. His mentor, Johann von Stoppitz, tried to direct Luther to focus on Jesus Christ instead of his sin. Von Stoppitz taught that true repentance does not involve punishment. But it starts with changing yourself. On April 3, 1507, Bishop of Brandenburg Jerome Schultz ordained Luther in Erfurt Cathedral. A year later, he was sent to teach theology at the University of Wittenberg. He received his Bachelor of Scripture Studies on March 9, 1508 and received another bachelor's degree in Doer Books of Sentences by Peter Lombard in 1509. He received the title of Doctor of Theology on October 19, 1512 and two days later, he was accepted into the Senate of the University of Wittenberg's Faculty of Theology. The beginning of the Protestant Reformation in 1516, a Dominican priest named Johann Tetzel was sent to Germany by Holy Rome to sell pardons. His experience as pardon priest between 1503 to 1510 led to his appointment as Commissioner General by the Archbishop of Mainz Albrecht von Brandenburg. October 31, 1517 Luther wrote to von Brandenburg protesting the sale of pardons for funds to build St. Peter's Basilica in Rome. At the age of 27 years, Luther had the opportunity to delegate at the Conference of the Catholic Church in Rome. There, he was saddened by the corruption and immorality among the priests. In the midst of his study of the scriptures, he experienced enlightenment when he read Psalm 22 while preparing lecture materials. There it is written about the lamentation and suffering of Jesus facing the crucifixion. A lament akin to disappointing Luther to religion and God. 
Two years later while preparing lectures on the Apostle Paul's letter to the Romans, he read those who will truly live by faith. He had said before he understood that the key to spiritual salvation was not being enslaved to religious dogma, but believing that faith itself brought salvation. It was at this time that he experienced a major life change during the Protestant Reformation. The letter of protest to Archbishop von Brandenburg became known as the 95 Theses which, within two weeks, spread throughout Germany. Then the writing spread to France, England, and Italy in 1519. Scholars headed to Wittenberg to listen to Luther's lectures. Excommunication with the papacy after theses spread, in June or July 1519, Luther declared that the scriptures did not give the Pope the exclusive right of interpretation. The statement was a direct attack on the papal authorities. June 15, 1520, Pope Leo sent a letter containing threats. The letter threatened Luther with excommunication unless he retracted 41 sentences from the letter, including the test within 60 days. On December 10, 1520, Luther burned the letter leading Pope Leo to excommunicate on January 3, 1521. On April 18, 1521, he was called to the Diet of Worms a meeting connected with Holy Rome in the city of Worms. There, Luther again insisted he was innocent, and asked to be shown to prove his argument, which the council could not do. Therefore, on May 8, 1521, the council issued the decree of Worms prohibiting Luther from writing, and declared him a convict of heresy. The decree was made as if cursed and a fugitive. A friend later helped hide him in Wartburg Castle. While in hiding, Luther translated the New Testament into German so the public could understand it. Lutheran sect despite being under threat of arrest, Luther decided to return to the Wittenberg Church Castle in Eisenach. In May 1522, he set up a new church known as Lutheranism which was found to have the support of the German prince and his followers. When the Peasants' War broke out in 1524, Luther chose to side with the rulers to keep his church growing. A year later, Luther married Katharina von Bora, a former nun who left the convent and fled to Wittenberg, with whom they had six children. The end and death between 1533 and 1546, Luther served as Dean of Theology at the University of Wittenberg. At that time, his health began to decline. He suffered from Meniere's disease, vertigo, digestive problems, and a cataract in one eye. Pain and emotional problems affected his writing. Some language that contains feelings and is rude to some elements of society, including the Jews. On February 18, 1546 at 2.45 a.m., Luther died at the age of 62 in Aisleben after suffering a stroke. His body is buried in Wittenberg, just below the pulpit.